Hello, a very warm welcome to Moose Fitness TV, where today you'll be doing a 15 minute all standing car workout, which I'm sure you're going to enjoy. It's more of a walking workout, however, we're going to concentrate on our core area, and in today's session, I'll be using some one kilo dumbbells. Don't worry if you've got no weights, stick to body weight moves only, however, if you don't have any light weights in the house, get dusting off the cobwebs, alright, get those out and use them, and if it gets too much, put them down and stick to body weight moves. So, the workout it's a one round only session. 15 exercises, you'll be working 40 seconds on, and then you'll be marching for 20 seconds while you watch me demonstrate the next move. Okay, everything today is going to go at steady pace, it's low impact, knee friendly, all right, and go at your own pace, own range of motion. So, that being said, get some water to one side, get yourself ready, and see you in the workout. Today's 15 minute all standing car workout. Are you feeling fit and well? Looking forward to today's session, okay? Right, so all I want you to do is start marching nice and slowly. Let's move those arms while I demonstrate this first exercise, okay? Right, you keep moving, watch this. Right foot forward, arm nice and high. We're gonna lean over and raise that knee. I want you to strip it nice and tight, and then we're gonna come back, okay? Get in position. All right, let's go. Pause at the top, and then come back out. So we're doing this side for 20 seconds, and then we're going to straight onto the other side, all right? 20 seconds on that side. Make sure you do that lean over. Everything today is steady state cardio, okay? So no fast moves. Okay, change foot, left foot forward. That's it, raising that right knee. Remember, like I mentioned in the intro, that if you are using weights, you have been warned, keep them light. If it gets too much, put them down. Make sure you lean over. Well done, back to marching. So first exercise, cross stop. Right, I do this next exercise quite regular, okay, but normally I do them fast. Today we're doing them slow. So it's arms up, elbow to knee, back up. Okay? Are you ready? Alright, let's go. So again, tighten your stomach as you bring the elbow to that knee. Slow is the new fast today. Keep going. Right, see the time at 10 seconds. Make sure you pause when you get elbow to that knee. Shake out those shoulders, okay, so they, they should be warming up now. You might feel them burning a little bit. Right, all we're going to do now, put your arms together. We're going to swing to the side, okay? Swing to the side. Just bring that foot out as we do that swing, all right? Not yet, though. You've got three seconds. Right, get yourself ready. All right, let's go. Try your nice straight arms. Again, keep that stomach nice and tight. So even though this is a car workout, you'll notice by now, other muscles are starting to say hello to you. Right, 10 seconds, come on. Three, two, one. Well done, well done. Right, okay, so next exercise, all we're going to do is have your arms up. I think you can a little bit now, you can bring them down. Keep marching, by the way. Right, all we're going to do is toe touches. Okay, so you're either up here. Oh, we're staying down there, okay? You've got the choice. Let's go. I'll mix and match. Nice straight leg if we can. Right, let's slow it down a little bit more. Okay, keep that core nice and tight. Going. Last five 
five seconds. Well done. Right. So, all we do this time, bring your right foot forward, get a fighting stance, right, and we're going to push to the side. So even though our lower half staying there, our upper body's moving, okay? We're going to do 20 seconds on this side, and then we're going to change. Here we ready? Let's go. So our upper body now should be turning around. Again, don't go too fast. We've got 10 more seconds and then we're going to change to the other side. That's it. Feel that stretch. Keep that swimming nice and tight. Okay, let's change stance. Stance, diagonal punches, right. That's it, come on. Right, 10 seconds. You should feel it when you, your obliques there, your muscles at the side of your waist. Well, a lot of people have love handles. Okay, well done, well done. Right, this time with the four open reaches, so what I'm going to do, this arm can come down, one, this is the speed, okay? We're going to fall on this side, and then we're going to fall on the other. Keep marching. Here we go, let's go. So, we're leaning over. Is that far? <laughs> the far of the side. I'm a bloke, I can't speak into the movement at the same time. There we go. It's multitasking. That's the one. Reach out, man. make sure you're still nice and tight. Other side. Well done, well done. Right, okay. So, front, foot, front leg forward. So I've got my right leg forward, okay. All I'm going to do now, high knee again, do it nice and tight. I'm going to rotate my upper body, okay? I'm going to do work 20 seconds on one side, 20 on the other. All right, let's go. Step back with high knees and upper body rotation left. Make sure you keep that core engaged. Three seconds. One. Let's change. Step back with high knee with upper body rotation right. So this is really good for balance, okay? Last ten. Keep going. Three, Three two, two, one. One, well done. Next. Right, what we got next? Keep marching. Right, okay, so all we're gonna do now. Put your hands together, so if you haven't got weights, you need to let your fingers put your side step. And we're going to bring our arms to the side, so we're bringing those arms in as an arm pull, okay? Three, Just to the side. Two, you ready? Alright, join me, let's go. Again, nice and slow, stomach nicely engaged. This also works your chest, you should feel your chest muscles activated. Right, last ten. Three, two, one. Well done, keep moving, keep moving. Right, we really bring it down now. The option, you have your arms crossed, get the stomach nicely engaged, knee up, back down, knee up, back down, okay. Okay, keep our arms up, makes it a little bit more harder. Up. Down. You ready? Let's get your shoes. Again, engage that stomach nice and tight. Get your shoes. Give it a very good balance. This is the position you want to be in. Otherwise, arms up. Those people will wait. I hope you chose wisely. Last time. Three, two, one. 
Well done. Right, okay. Keep moving, keep marching. Just trying to read what I've got. I've got a long sentence on my tablet there. All <laughs> right. So, all we do this time, from here we're going to keep our feet in the same spot. Okay, nice wide, bit of a bend. All we're going to do is come all the way down and back. Come on. All the way down and back. Okay, ready? Side bend, reach. Again, keep your stomach nice and tight. We're just going out diagonally, 45 degrees. Right, 20 seconds. Right, last time. Well done. Right, okay, so. Next exercise, we're going to do knee drives again. Arms are going to be nice and straight, okay? So your right foot forward again, stomach nice and tight. Okay, we're going to bring them down. Are you ready? Not yet. You got three seconds. I've just seen the timer. Let's go. Knee drives straight, arm pull back. So again, 20 seconds either side. Imagine with your stomach, I want your stomach nice and tight. Imagine you're deflecting an object coming towards you, okay? That's it. Three, two, one. Okay, other side. So you should bring your left foot nice, follow me. Again, straight arms. Bring those arms down nice and fast. So you bring that knee up. This is smiling. Okay, so the next side's crossed off. Right, so now we're going to go a little bit faster, okay? All we're going to do from here, we're going to go four bends, so keep hips facing me. Four times, I'll kick to either side, and then we're going to do two, uh, sorry, four elbow to knee. Okay, so four upper body rotation, four elbow to knee, okay? Slowly, one. Static upper body rotation, then elbow to knee. Now we're going to speed it up. And slow down. Are you getting on? Did you want to feel it around your car yet? Yeah? Give it there. Okay, right, get marching. Next exercise. We're doing four punches and then four kicks. Okay, so we're going to stay here with the punches. One, two, three, four. And then we're going to do a nice straight kick. So, okay, bring those arms down to the side. Are you ready? Get some position. Punches first. Four X, four punches, then kicks. And then four kicks. Back to punches. Keep that stomach nice and tight. So none of the exercises today should be too taxing, okay? That's why it's called steady stay. It's all about strengthening and shaping our core. But we're working other muscles at the same time. Oh, well done. Get back to matching. So, how are we doing so far? We've got two minutes left, all right? Two exercises. Right, okay, so, what we're gonna do? Arms are gonna be at the front, all right? We're gonna rotate, rotate, foot tap, foot tap, okay, you ready? Let's go, something nice and tight. Upper body rotations, then real foot taps. Right, reach down for that foot. It doesn't matter which foot you actually use first. Oh, wrong hand. <laughs> that again. Oh, what's happening to me? I won't edit that out. Come on. Okay, 
Right, well done, right. Last exercise, you're gonna make it cross, okay? You're gonna be up here, you're gonna bring your foot in, foot up so as your hand comes down, keep your other arm up in the air, okay? Just a bit nice and tight. Keep marching. You've got five seconds, okay? Right, now you can get that cross. Okay, let's go. Again, I'm trying to slow it down, I'm so tempted to go fast, but not today. Steady stay. Just a bit nice and tight. Last exercise. Keep going. Keep going. See the time is counting down. Last 10 seconds and we're finished. Keep going. Well done, you. Okay, I'm just going to turn the music off. I'll be back in a second. So, how do you get on today's session? You'll see directly below this video, just down there, there's a little comments box. Let me know how you did. Don't be shy. Just give me a short message. Right, did you stick to body weight moves only? Were you using weights? If so, what were the weight you were using? And were you able to manage it all the way through the workout? And more importantly, how did you think to the session itself? I can read them and then I can create from your feedback new sessions just to suit your needs, okay? It's always a pleasure having you on board doing the sessions with me. I do appreciate it and I hope you enjoyed the session as much as I enjoyed doing it with you, okay? Don't be a stranger though. Keep coming back. Try three, four sessions, especially the, the low impact cardio workouts or the walking workouts each week and it's really good for your fitness and health journey and especially for the weight loss journey because it'll help raise your metabolism levels and it'll help that which means you'll burn fat a lot more quicker okay so that's enough from me now until next time thanks again for doing the workout bye